I want to turn to Murfreesboro, where their growth continues to create new challenges for that community. One of those is a need for more airport space. News 4's Lindsay Nance spoke with officials about how they plan to expand the terminal. With business in the city booming, more and more companies are flying into Murfreesboro. This airport has been here since 1952 and needs some improvements, especially since it's one of the busiest general aviation sites in the state. And just about every restaurant and store that comes in and out of Murfreesboro, somebody associated with those companies comes through here. Since Gerke started managing this airport 20 years ago, Murfreesboro's population has more than tripled. With businesses flying in and out every week in MTSU's growing flight program, the airport has to have more space, but couldn't afford it. The company they hired made it fit within their budget. Now the city hopes the $4.5 million terminal attracts more businesses to the area. The city of Murfreesboro is always looking to uh, get that next headquarters, that next business, attract them to this community provide jobs and things like this. This terminal will hopefully represent Murfreesboro, make a great impression. Starting with a large raised lobby full of windows with high ceilings and lounge seating. The contractor, Smith Design Build, also drew in the plans as space for Air Method's Life Flight Emergency at Vanderbilt and training centers for the MTSU Aerospace Program. Gerke wants the terminal to be open to the public as well. We'll also have some large business space for for organizations and businesses in the community to come out and have events, uh, meetings, training. Gerke wants the terminal to make a lasting impact on people when they visit and draw them in. Construction on the terminal will begin in January and officials say they hope it'll be done in a year or a little more. In Murfreesboro, Lindsay Nance, News 4.